All right, so we got Call of Duty Black Ops 6. The replacer is the weekend. Let's get right to the video. All right, Abel, we're rolling. Hey, come on, bring that beef back. Oh, hey, no. Hold on. Oh, I might have to. I might have to. Black Ops 6, don't you okay. worry. Okay. I'm the mother <laughs> star boy. <laughs> oh, I, 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 let's I have to mute the copyright real quick. But, uh, so we got... Oh man, listen. At the end, I kind of have to like mute like the weekend, um, like sing or whatever, because you know, bro, YouTube be going crazy whenever it comes to music and stuff like that. So I kind of have to mute that at the end. But we got Call of Duty Black Ops Six coming through October twenty fifth. Obviously, um, you know, listen, we all know this. We've seen like the previous, like you know, the replacer trailers and stuff like that. So you guys will actually be getting two replacer videos. Uh, kind of like at the same time, I might schedule them, like minutes like after each other. Uh, let me get listen. Let me get a sip of water, and then we're gonna talk about like Call of Duty Black Ops Six or whatever. Uh, the hype around it, you know, what I'm excited for and stuff like that, so. Mm. Okay. Now, whenever it comes to Black Ops 6, right, I'll probably say, like, one thing that I'm really excited about, obviously, uh, is the uh, Omni movement. If you guys haven't seen, I actually have some gameplay on my channel where I've actually played, you know, the Black Ops 6 beta. And to be fair, man, um, it, it was, here's the thing, right? All Call of Duties are cheesy, which is, you know, and that I think... You can't even, uh, like, I won't use that as an excuse for the gameplay, whatever. Because at the end of the day, no matter what type of, like, you know, no matter what type of, like, uh, game style that Call of Duty puts in the game, no matter, no, like, no matter what type of, you know, um, yeah, no matter, like, what type of style, you know, people use or whatever, people are going to exploit it. That is, that's, that is what it is. We've seen it time and time again, year after year after year, Call of Duty Black Ops 3, Call of Duty Black Ops 2. Uh, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, both Modern Warfare 2s, uh, both Modern Warfare 3s, people always exploit each Call of Duty. That's just what, it is what it is. When you've been having a game come out every single year for that long, people are going to learn how to make workarounds, you know, because some people, they don't just, they don't go with the Call of Duty way of playing the game. So they want to, like, you know, like, bro, like, think about it, slide canceling, bro. Slide canceling was so, at the time when slide, when slide canceling first came through, um, when did slide canceling first come through? It came then, but I think slide canceling came through like like a long time ago. But I remember uh Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2019, right? Where you couldn't really slide cancel like that, but people like made a way to like slide cancel like on mouse and keyboard or whatever. And then like controller players made their way, and then people started making YouTube videos on how to slide cancel stuff like that. Like that's an exploit. Like 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 bro, like slide canceling is an exploit. That's not a Call of Duty movement type of thing. Call of Duty like Call of Duty didn't mean like they didn't mean to put slide cancel in the game. Like people that played this game for a very long time, they was like, dang, like how can I run across this field or whatever without getting sniped because. Like, no matter if I have double time on, like, I'm, I can still get sniped. So how can I throw off, like, the snipers and stuff like that? Like, how can I move in, like, an awkward way? How can I, like, you know, like, slip and slide or whatever? Like, obviously, sliding, that was a, obviously, is a thing in Call of Duty. And that's been a thing, you know, for, for some time now. And so people, like, on, and I think it started from uh, mouse and keyboard. People created this thing to where, like, you know, you can slide and you can, like, like slide and stop. You can stop sliding and, like. You can run, slide, then stop. Run, slide, then stop. You can kind of like throw off of like the sniper's uh like you know uh like rhythm basically. You, you can like yeah, like, it, it's kind. It was so cheesy. Whenever I first saw like pros doing it, they was like slide canceling and stuff like that. It was nasty work, but that's an exploit, you know. And, and that's something that a lot of people learn how to do, you know, from these pros, you know. Just like um um another thing um what's another like exploit. I wouldn't really call this an exploit, but like this is a strat that everybody used now that I saw pros use. Um, the smoke, the, like the smoke strat, bro. It it's so crazy because ever since I started, um, you know, seeing pros use the whole smoke strat where you're running or whatever, and all they have to do is just throw like a bunch of smoke grenades to like, you know, obviously it's gonna like blind your vision to see like where they are or whatever, and they can just like you know revive their teammate or they can just run to like another place or they can just reroute and they can just flank. Uh, around you and kill you, whatever, by just throwing the smoke, and, like, you can't see them, whatever. Like, that whole smoke strat, that's not, I mean, again, it's not an exploit, but that's a strat that nobody were using until, like, I saw, like, a lot of pros use it, and then, like, you know, streamers were using it, and then, obviously, like, a lot of people were using it. Like, that's the cycle, technically. Like, you see, like, a lot of these pros and streamers, you know, use something, and I'm not saying that, like, it's, like, they're following nothing, I'm, and it's not even technically, like, a bad thing. It's just crazy on how, on how fast something can move like how on how fast 
uh, like a trend in Call of Duty can move. Not even just a trend in Call of Duty, but just a trend in every single game. You know, like like like, like the whole smoke strat of you dropping three or four smokes or whatever, and you just smoking your entire area so nobody can see what you're doing. You, or you could basically just like, you could basically just like heal up in the smoke. Nobody can see you or whatever. And, and it's crazy on how fast like something can move, bro. It, bro, it moved like like wildfire. It was crazy, like how everybody like even I'm using like the whole smoke strat. You know, like and, like if I'm getting like um. Like if me and my squad is getting like pinned down, right? Let's say some. Let's say um, we're in like the final circle, and let's say we're in like um, I don't know. Let's say it's the final circle. We're in we're in uh, Rebirth Island, and let's say the final circle is around Grandma's house. We all know where Grandma's house is. Like it's like right next to prison. It's like the house right next to prison. Whatever. Let's say that's like the final circle. If I'm down on like the lower level where the buy station is and Grandma's house is, if I'm between there. And you have like a couple people on the roof. What I can do is I can throw like a couple smokes or whatever, smoke that entire area so they don't they don't know where I am. I can hurry up and like buy my teammates back if they're dead. I can hurry up and run into like the uh into the window into like the lower window in grandma's house and just hide there and camp there or whatever. And then you know they're gonna have to move and I could just uh like shoot them while they're jumping off the prison. Like bro, it, there's so many things you can do while you're having these smokes and stuff like that. And a lot of people won't they're not even thinking about that you know and i don't blame them because like when you're in a moment of like a final like a uh when you're in like the moment of like a final uh circle or whatever you tend to not really think about stuff like that but since it's a known strat everybody's throwing the smokes throwing three or four smokes so nobody can see them and the guys on the roof are going to jump off and they just get beamed out the sky because like you know like the smoke strat actually works so if i'm being completely honest with you like it, it, it's crazy on how like uh, it's crazy on how like advanced Call of Duty is now. So with the whole Call of Duty Black Ops uh, 16 with the Omni movement and how cheesy it is, I mean that's just it comes with the game, you know. Um, another another thing that I'm actually excited for Black Ops 6 was whenever I actually played the beta, bro. I don't. It was fun, bro. It was fun. It was addicting. It was fun. Um, it felt like, it felt new. You know, it didn't feel like any of the. I mean, obviously, you know, Modern Warfare and Black Ops they have like two complete different. You know, playing styles obviously is by two complete different studios. So, us Call of Duty players, we kind of have to like. I feel like here's the thing, right? And some people can disagree with me, whatever. I feel like whenever it comes to you know uh, Black Ops and Modern Warfare, I do like Call of Duty Modern Warfare story more. But let me tell you something. My play style, one thousand percent fits with Black Ops play style, one million percent. I don't know what it is. Even though I like Modern Warfare more. My play style fits with Black Ops uh, 6, like, not even just Black Ops 6, but just Black Ops just in general. I think Treyarch did a really good job with just like on, on like how on like how the game moves and how the game runs. Like, I, I don't know. I just like it better. Um, for like Activision, whenever it comes to like the uh, whenever it comes to like the um, what do you call it? Uh, Modern Warfare side, it's not bad or nothing. Like, bro, they can create one hell of a story. It's just whenever it comes to like. I don't know. It feels stiffer. It feels slower whenever it comes to the Modern Warfare side. But, bro, for the Black Ops side, bro, it is so, like, smooth. And so, even though it's cheesy, it's so smooth, bro. It's smooth. It's fast. Like, you get to you get to pop off if you really want to. I don't know, bro. It, it's something about the Black Ops side, bro. I feel like a lot of Call of Duty players can really relate to the whole Black Ops side, especially multiplayer. Oh, my goodness. Uh, other than that, man, um, yeah, it's fun. It's cheesy. You know, it is what it is. But man, I have, bro, I got really high hopes, bro, for this game. I played the beta, man. Really high hopes. I, I like the maps. I, I can definitely um I'll probably say like my favorite map in the game. Um My favorite map in the game is definitely um the map with like the mansion or whatever. It has like the swimming pool in the middle. I that's probably like my favorite map. I'll probably say my second favorite map is probably Baby what was it Baby Lawn? Um that it that map is big. It is cheesy though because if you know where the spawns are, hopefully, you know, um, Treyarch can actually fix the spawns on a map because you, you can basically just spawn camp. You can have, like, it, it, like I remember uh, playing, like, um, Domination. Bro, we had A. Me and my team were on A. We spawned there for, like, 50 times. We spawned that week because we, like, it was, like, because basically, if you guys don't know, whenever it comes to Domination, if your team has a flag, then most likely you're going to spawn there. So we spawned that. We kept spawn, uh, spawning that A. And we basically just got, we, we got spawn camped basically because you had people, as soon as you came out of the spawn, you got sniped from all the way over there, 
because they were just looking and like, bro, like they had, it was basically just free kills. Like, and so hopefully they can like, you know, fix up some of the spawns stuff like that. Um, but other than that, man, I'm pretty excited about the game. Comment down below, man. What do you guys think about uh, Call of Duty Black Ops 6? And um, other than that, man, that's pretty much it. Make sure you guys like the video, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. And 